Today we're at Juju Photo Factory. Juju does these um, events relatively often that really supports the lo local Austin art. What did you call it? Alternative culture in Austin, yeah. I wish I had said that because it makes me sound a lot smarter. You, you do either shoot the band or shoot the model and just tell me a little bit about that. I wanted to open up the studio to, you know, local artists um, and I, I thought it was a good way to like get them some professional shots and professional equipment and invite, you know, eight photographers to come and shoot them and so it's like a symbiotic exchange of promotional materials. Jessica Clark found me one day and she's a jewelry designer, industry chains, and um, she said, why don't we do it for fashion? I am the events coordinator for Shoot the Model, also the stylist, and today I played makeup artist. What, who are these girls? Shoot the model. These are the juicy girls. Juicy! I gotta figure out how to make this really interesting in like five seconds. I'm gonna need you to take off your clothes. <laughs> I mean the dudes should not take off their fucking clothes because dudes are not, they don't look that cool naked. To each their own. Yeah. Most people are gonna agree with me though. So we started uh, shoot, the, shoot the Model and we would um, pair up with a local designer and give them a chance to bring in their models to find their vision and their sets and, uh, and you know, have uh, 10 photographers come in and shoot it and, and myself and how I would pay them is you know, giving them the contact sheets and the rights to use the images for free. Well she said a whole lot of shit. Yeah, I said a lot yeah, of I'm shit. I'm going to edit it to where you sound smart. Like Today we're excited to be uh, showcasing Federico Archuleta artwork. He did, he did that girl's boobs. Federico did your painting, right? He did. Normally I would just like look at her nipples, but like I look at the whole thing. Yeah. Um, That's how you know art's good. I think it's beautiful, honestly. I was a little intimidated at first when I heard the concept of it, but it came out okay. It's your first time modeling? Yeah, I've never modeled before. They told me about the model mayhem or something like that to put my pictures on. All my model friends that have gotten on Model Mayhem, they're like, if they're attractive, they have like a million emails that come through and it's like, hey, really creepy, let's go shoot in a van or something. How would people look you up again? Um, on Facebook, Lauren, what's our Facebook stuff? Facebook.com forward slash Juicy Lifestyles. I'm trying to give you a reason, you know, so not to go to the bar. Well, you can go to the bar later. Come here first, make some art, then we go to the bar. And it's right down the street. For, this is on 6th Street, so it's right down the street from east side. I can walk a couple blocks away and it gets super hipster, trendy, kick-ass dudes and chicks. I was going to say chicks first, and because I said dudes first, I don't want that to come off as gay, but I'm not a homophobe. I'm just super straight. 